Hello Collective, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're doing well this morning. Hmm. Let's dive right into the messages, shall we? See what spirit has for us after that night of the 2-2 portal. I don't know how it went for you, but um, it was intense. Spirit, what is it that you would like the collective to know at this time? Please and thank you. We've got somebody in regret, disappointment and failure. Challenge by... A queen of pentacles. Mother figure. In the subconscious. We've got the hanged man reversed. Looks like somebody took a hit by this queen of pentacles. by mama in the recent past we've got the knight of pentacles so hard work responsibility somebody might have made an offer intention and expectation <clears throat> Um, a rebirth, a positive rebirth, wealth and security, and high priestess, divine feminine. So this is what the Knight of Pentacles sees when he's making an offer. He's what He wants to become a king of pentacles, and he thinks he can do that by hooking up with a high priestess who is the sun in the near future. Um, we've got a page of wands. Free spirit. Limitless potential. Lens they're looking through. Wow. All these cards came out. The lens they're looking through. So you got the empress here. Too many crickets, guys. Who's a star? The higher fence here. Um, disconnecting somebody um, who is in a Nine of Cups reverse. Somebody who's snug and materialistic. So it looks like the Empress is here, who's a star, the, the Hierophant, who could be the Most High, is disconnecting somebody who is um, materialistic and indulgent. So he's not allowing this connection to be made in the environment. Oops. Wow, these all just came out. So in the environment, there are negative thoughts regarding um, this generous wealth. And somebody's disappointed in having to walk away. And the um, hopes and fears. Judgment. And um, the outcome. Is a three of swords reversed. Recovery and moving on. And the lovers.
Oh, shoot, I don't even have this on. Here, hopefully that's better. <clears throat> Sorry about that. Hopefully you can hear the first part okay. So we've got uh, five of cups. Somebody's re in regret. They failed. They're in disappointment, pessimism, loss, and grief. And it's this tribe. They're challenged by a queen of cups. Um, financially... Um, Stable mother figure, parent figure, a working parent. And <clears throat> they're challenged because you are just you. And you've got this Queen of Pentacles here um, standing on your behalf. She knows who you are. These ones may be trying to slander you, but she knows who you are. And they're challenged because she knows who you are. No matter what they say about you, um, it's not working. She knows who you are, and there are delays and resistance to this um, slander that they're trying to do. And it's prophecy. There's a Knight of Pentacles coming in, trying to make a, a small offer, wanting a leadership role. They want a leadership role. So they're trying to connect with you because you're the son and you're the high priestess. And he wants to be a king of pentacles. And he knows he can be that with you and have this leadership role. You are being remembered or you have been remembered <clears throat> that's that's one scenario or it could be that you're not only the sun high priestess but you're also the empress star and this tribe is trying to take you out before you can hook up with your leadership role or whatever. They want somebody else to hook up with you, to marry you, to like step into the leadership role, like to take that role from you. Be very wary of who you're hooking up with. Your divine counterpart is out there, but there are these <clears throat> knights and pages who are trying to step in. This one came out sideways, so I'm going to take it as a reverse. This page of wands is a free spirit, excited. Um, he may not be a teacher. Or maybe he hasn't been taught um, by this tribe. But it looks like they're targeting, yeah, this, this, like there's two people here. A knight of pentacles wants to be a king of pentacles. And this page of wands is, is jealous about this six of pentacles. So he wants to hook up with this empress star. So you've got two people here trying to hook up with you. But the almighty himself is like, nope, you're going to be, you're going to be disconnected. And, um, no, because you're, because you're all about materialism. And this is not what this is all about. could be time it's time for her to shine it's time for her to shine so in the previous cycle it was dominated by the masculine and I do feel that there is a bunch of masculines who are coming in and they're trying to hook up with this shining one or these shining ones um, to dominate their gift 
so that they can continue in their role of authority. Somebody's having negative thoughts. They're feeling um, um, and trapped because of your generous um, sharing of wealth. And they're disappointed because they have to leave it behind. They could have been bound from this Six of Pentacles. Restricted. Imprisoned. Like they don't get this and they have to walk away. It's weird because the Six of Pentacles is here. It's in the upright, but it's not there for them. It's there for those who are optimistic and happy. It's, it's there for those who are optimistic and happy just being themselves. They're not pretending being somebody else. They're not trying to walk in somebody else's shoes. They're... They're um, genuine. So there's judgment um, being called for under this religion. Judgment's being called on this religion. This religion could be undergoing a rebirth. Um, there could be a complete new um, rewriting of religious practices. I don't know, perhaps. A new phase it's a new phase for religion that's what that is and it's a release of um, this three of swords in the reverse so we've got a release of pain and recovery and moving on and peace Attention is being brought to, um, wow. Okay, attention is being brought to those with knowledge here and now who did nothing. They didn't defend themselves. They didn't fight with anybody. They didn't attack anybody. They didn't hate anybody. And they're coming into their spiritual throne. This um, this explorer was expecting your shine. This explorer was expecting to take your shine. But you survived. Um, you survived all of the all of the stuff that they did to you. Just as is by meditating, by taking care of yourself, by self love. And this player is now haunted and they might feel like they martyred themselves. I think they martyred themselves. And, and they're trying to make a visitation. The snake is vis making visitations to people. This is what I'm talking about. So there's a snake making um, energetic visitations to people who are important. Like this sun, empress, em, um, high priestess, star. So who are important because he wants to change. He wants to change what's going on. Once this, once this father figure leaves, he wants to change who the service members are. Okay, so he's bringing fight because he wants your privilege. And he wants you to put you back. He wants to put these wholesome people back into a position where they have to preserve themselves. And they find it funny. They find it entertaining to do this to people who are about self-care. This is what their plan is. It doesn't matter what's going on here. As soon as the big daddy leaves, that's what their plan is. They're looking at both sides of the situation. They're perceiving this. These vain people, they want your purpose. Okay, they want your promise and they're spying on you. And they're they're trying to figure out how um, they can puppet you and get the home front to see you or to see them as you and accept them and their ancestry as you. So they're laboring to compete with you because they want your evermore and they want your body. 
So be very careful. Energetically, these um, guys who martyred themselves, they're still out there. The energies are still out there. And they're spying on these high priestess, empresses, stars. And they're energetically attacking them, trying to, what, overtake their body to body snatch them. So now we got, now we got body snatching going on. This is where the walk-ins occur. So this whole tribe is under regret. They're disappointed. They're led by a mature man, whoever he is. Challenged by a queen of pentacles. And you, being you. Challenged by your innocence, by your purity. They're in despair over this coming together this is prophecy and they are they ha they don't have any control um, they have a fear of sacrifice they're stalling they're they're at, in an indecision they may not know who to try Like they need the leader, right? The leader. They need the leader with this great fortune. And she's a she. She's a main female. And he's and he's and he wants to be high honor. He wants to be high honor because he's facing judication. So he needs to hook up with you and get covered uh, by your high honor. And become a king of pentacles. Now I don't know. It could very well be that this knight of pentacles is somebody who you are hooking up with. And by hooking up with you he does become a king of pentacles. But it looks to me like he's looking at you because he's under judication. And that's that's what he is. He's, he's, a, he's a knight of pentacles who's got you in his thoughts because he's under judication. You're a high honor female, high priestess, son, who can make him a king of pentacles, a leader with great fortune. And he can, he can get out of this judication if he hooks up with you. This page of wands here, who's not a teacher, is working on behalf of this mature woman who is part of this tribe, who is part of this tribe, working with the mature man to sabotage these relationships or this relationship. Like these people, I think, were the leaders. This tribe was the leader of the planet or whatever. And they're being knocked out. And so they're trying to get their way back in. So they see you. You're the new leader. You've been given this. Um, you're like this amazing person. Sunny, high priestess, main female, high honor, freaking empress, star. Who's at peace. Who has, who's got this purity about you. And it was prophesied that you would show up. You're very optimistic. Yeah, prophecy and time. So these ones are like, they're like, how do I get into this sudden wealth? How do I get that, right? Because they want it. They're very concerned. This wealthy man is very concerned because th there's been a wealth transfer to you and your community. This, this whole community is experiencing a change. They might be facing imprisonment. That whole tribe, yeah. But you're going on a journey into this house and you're going to get a marriage. Okay, you're a privileged lady coming into a gift. Wow. Wow. 
and somebody, this official person, um, might be in bad health because they were working to try to steal your pathway. That's wild. So there's some expectation here. It's time. The Hierophant's here, the Most High. He's disconnecting these people who are all about materialism. And um, yeah, so he's aware. Mama's aware. Somebody's having a lot of negative thoughts because you're going to be generous and they are going to be disappointed. They, they won't be receiving your generosity. They won't be receiving the generosity of this optimistic person. Because, because why? Because they try to destroy her. Yeah, this optimistic person is coming into this house and she's going to be very generous. She's going to be very generous and there's going to be a disappointment. Somebody's in, in a lot of bad thoughts about this because they're bound from your generosity. There is a new phase for the religion. And they don't, they're not going anywhere on the distant horizons. Judgment. There's going to be a, a healing of this heartbreak, a moving on, a recovery, and a, a restoration of peace. And um, they, there, there won't be any need to be concerned. There's a wealthy man here. Who might be a sudden, who might be an official person who, who is a thief. They're getting a message of concern that the work they had, that the work they've been doing is like ending. They're in bad health. And this pathway is open for this privileged lady. She's coming into her marriage and her gift. These false people are getting a message. They might be called into the courthouse. For the work that they've done against this main male and his relationship. His, his relationship with this main female, who is the son, high priestess, empress star. Yeah, his courtship, his unexpected income. So the, whatever, whatever was being done in this family room, what it's getting them is um, poverty and a journey to prison. And there's going to be a change for this whole community. Yeah, so this tribe is in a, a big, they failed. They're in big regret. They were not able to fix the connection. They're challenged because you have a new commitment. And it's viable. No matter how they've been working to um, vilify you or victimize you, it's a viable commitment. The mother knows 
the mother knows she's watching you. So the mother of this main male, she knows and she's keeping tabs on you. And she's challenging this tribe. Ego upside down. So now um, their pride is hurt. They're in despair. They're out of control. They don't have any control. This Queen of Pentacles is like, and the Hierophant is like, mm -mm -mm. oh, they feel broken because they ran out of time. They spent all their time trying to destroy you. <laughs> And then you won, right? And now it's like, oh no, now they want to try to come in and be a, in a relationship. <laughs> or body snatch, yeah, I don't know. Whatever. Take it as you will. They're guilty. They're guilty and they're under adjudication. They can't get you out of their thoughts. So this um, main female is here in the near future with this page of wands and they're going to try to gain a soul contract. Okay, but you're already in a commitment. They're going to try to they're going to try to come in and gain a soul contract. They're going to try to in the 3D before your main male shows up. They're going to try to come in and, and hook you up. They're showing this um, this page of wands like he's not part of the old group like he's this he's this free spirit you know he's excited and he's free but look who's here it's the mature woman she's right here with this mature man part of this tribe coaching him it's saying he's not being taught but he is being taught she's here and she's in there and they're here trying to um, get a soul contract because they want your destiny. Be careful. Be careful of who you choose. Um, take your time. The right one won't mind. So they don't want to run anymore, right? They're running and they don't want to run anymore. So they want to hook up with you. They need your stability, your healing, your wealth. And... Um, or this could mean that they actually are running because the Hierophant has disconnected them because they are um, indulgent, you know? I don't know. They don't want to run anymore. They're a runner. I don't know. They've been running from, what, have they been running from God <laughs> a whole long time? I don't know. And maybe they've been hiding themselves because they've been able to latch onto this energy and, and cover themselves in the protection of these high priestesses and stuff. So if they gain relationship with the high priest, and then they're automatically covered by her protections, right? So then they can, they don't, so then they don't have to run from God. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, it, it, it could be. So somebody's having negative thoughts. They're feeling mentally bound. They're feeling um, entrapped because, and disappointed. And they feel abandoned by you. Because you're taking your wealth and your optimism and moving on into the house without them. Yeah, you've got new responsibilities. You've got a new family, a new commitment. They have to leave you alone. They don't want to and they're going to, they, they could try to like force this to go another way. But fortunately, you got people here looking after you um, as uncomfortable as it may be energetically and mentally and uh, emotionally and all of that right now it's it's okay yeah so there's judgment being called on this religion there is a new phase for religion they don't get to go forward into the distant horizons um, and there is an unexpected outcome 
things aren't going the way they thought they were going to go. There is a healing from this heartbreak. There is heartbreak, heartbreak. There is a release of the pain and a restoration of peace. And there won't be any need for concern in the future. Because um, those who were a reflection of you or trying to be you um, are going to be removed from you. They're going to be made to be away from you or maybe they have been disconnected from you already. So they've got habits and they want to have a conversation with you, but they're dishonest. Their values are about money and, and there's, there's too much damage. They're like, they may have felt a chemistry with you, but you were unsatisfied and detached. And they sabotaged your relationship and they're seeking forgiveness. They're a chaser. They have unfinished business and there's gossip about it. You're irreplaceable. You're irreplaceable. And they know it. They know it. They feel overwhelmed by your absence. They're daydreaming from the shadow side. Look at that. Without your light, they're in the shadow. And, and what? You escaped. <laughs> you were unappreciated. Or maybe you felt unappreciated. You probably were not unappreciated, but they may have treated you as though you were. I don't know. But they still have hope. They still have hope. They still have hope for a reunion and space in your life and part in your destiny. But it could be that you're coming into a reunion and there will be space made for you in this destiny. And they don't know what to do. They don't know what to do. They're having disagreements because you're in a new chapter. So yeah, um, the Most High God is here. Um, what the old dominion ensuring that the world keeps its promises and um, they are delivering on those promises. And then as soon as as soon as the Most High takes off, these guys are going to try to um, steal these soul contracts. They're going to. So it's going to be very. Just because you're in the position and have gotten the title doesn't mean that it's going to be easy. doesn't mean that people are going to just let you have it, right? You're going to have to defend your position probably the whole entire time you are in the position. It's just the way it goes. So this tribe is led by this mature man is in regret and they're in regret and they weren't able to mend the situation because you are balanced. Like they might have tried to throw you out of balance. They were seeking balance. They were seeking balance by throwing you out of balance perhaps. And they're challenged by your courage. Their ego, their pride is hurt over this death. Mama's not fooling around. She is not fooling around with her child. 
This is a new family tree, and she's not fooling around with her child. And they're in despair. They're in their imagination. They're in their imagination. They're feeling broken. They ran out of time. This Knight of Pentacles wanted to hook up with this sunny high priestess to gain a leadership role and great fortune. And it was all in their head. It was just imagination. They can't get you out of their thoughts. They're under adjudication. They're guilty for whatever they've done. Their intention was to get with you and be a king of pentacles because you're the sun, high priestess, main female, high honor. You're being remembered. You're being rewarded. And they don't have patience. And they don't understand that everything happens in divine order. And they're not part of this. So this mature woman is here uh, with a page trying to um, trick you into thinking that he's like this innocent purity right but he's ties he's 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 got us oh he's got a soul contract yeah he's got a soul contract to this mature woman so he may not be part of this tribe but he's got a soul contract to this mature woman somehow they're bound and so she wants him bound to you because that means that you will be bound to them They want forgiveness. Whoever this mother is, it's a false mother. It's a fake mother. It's not the it's not the mother. She might come in and try to pretend that she is the mother, but she's not the mother. It's an act. Yeah, these people, they're not your friends. They just want your stuff. And the Most High is here, um, right there, right there, right there. You are the Empress Star and the Hierophant is right here with you. Keeping these ones off you. They're in fear. They're in fear. They're bound. They're trapped. They're they're um, they have to leave it behind. They're withdrawing. And here you are, optimistic, generous, coming into the house with a new marriage, a new and and you're gonna have a child, a beautiful family. Judgment is being called on this religion. They don't get to go anywhere on the distant horizons. It's an unexpected outcome. They're blaming you. They blame you. Of course. With religion, it's like everybody's fault, right? Everybody but them is a sinner, right? There's a healing from this heartbreak and you're moving on to peace. There won't be any reason for concern. Those who were a reflection of you um, are separated. They're being made away from you. And they're thinking about it. Freedom. And these ones, man, they got habits. They're, they don't know what to do. 
There's been attention called on this wealthy man regarding what he's been doing to these lovers, these love relationships. They're trying to hide evidence. They hid evidence. They're challenged, yeah. Because you got a commitment here and you're a sweetheart. You're coming into your sweetheart. You're the you're the you're the new child of this of, of this mama. And she's protecting you. And her son, her son's mate from this tribe. Because they're going to have a new, um, they're going to create a new family tree. This is really important. She's fighting for it. And these ones, you know, um, they, they keep trying to vilify this beautiful being ooh they might have an accident ooh ooh and the death cards here they're in despair they did this as a profession this is what they do as a profession. They wait until the great fortune has been delivered and then they come in and they take it. <clears throat> What's that word? Is it Amadeus? Lover of God, loved by God? That's you. That's you. You're the sun, main female, high honor, high priestess, empress, star. You can't get better than that. What the heck? And the Most High himself is here protecting your union. This is wild, man. Your false friends fell into their trap. And I say that because, um, I say that because this is here. They were wanting your, um, your materialistic wealth. They're being disconnected. Oops. You're having sweet dreams. You're having sweet dreams. <laughs> You're relaxed. And they're facing homeless, homelessness. Homelessness, you know, with this, this has me, I'm thinking that it is a, a, a an actual death. And, and homeless means like the house, right? So this tells me that these ones don't have a house. And they, their energies may be present and they may be um, like attacking your house. So you may be having some energetic disturbances They're in a nightmare. 
This religious group is in a nightmare. And you're coming into your blessing and your freedom. And those who were a mere reflection of you, they're bound to their commitments. They tried to be you and they couldn't. That's what, they, that's what they're having. You will heal from this. They tried to put this on you. They did put this on you. They did put this on you. But you were able to, you were able to get, you were able to, um, it was able to be put back to its rightful place. So that's good. I mean, so yeah, somebody was coaching people. Wearing masks. To bring loss to your promise. But it's faded. You live and learn. Or maybe this is um, you living and learning through um, reading the cards. So you read the cards and that's how you know what's going on. Like it's your news, right? And you, this is how you find out that they're overloaded and that they're taking bribes or giving bribes to people to try to um, come up against your reunion, to come up against your homecoming. And they're protesting this. Mm -hmm. because they're sick and they're stressed out and, and they, they want to compromise. Mm -hmm. They want to compromise because you're coming into your eternal love and all they're left with is pride and stagnation. Good news. This is over. And with that, um, I'm going to leave this one where it's at. And I'm very happy. I'm very happy um, personally about this read. Um, it settles me a little bit. And I hope that it settles you as well. Have a great day, everybody. I'll see you on the next one.